Hi guys, welcome back to AVC. Today's going to be a juice review for change. Not done one for quite a while. About two weeks ago, Liquid Ice here in the UK sent me a new range that was being made by Tea Juice. At the time, it wasn't available. Now it's on the market. It's going to be called the Summertime Blues range from Tea Juice. There's three flavours. There's going to be Polarised, Blood Ice Orange and Minted. Now all of these are menthol vapes. If you're new to my channel, you might not know, I don't mind a menthol vape, but I can't vape it all day long. Just now and again, to give it a nice change. These are 50ml short fills. We had 10ml of a nick shot. I've not added any nicotine shot because I don't need to with the menthol. What I have done, I've added 7ml of VG and 3ml of PG to keep it the same 70-30 ratio to make it 60 mils in total in the bottle, so I can tell you what the flavors will be like if you do add a nick shot. Going to be vaping all these juices today in my little RDA. This is going to be the Rocket RDA from A Leader. The coil inside will be, of course, a nature vape. It's going to be a Tusker coil, coming in at a 0.4 ohm. The first juice I'm going to try is going to be the Minted. I'm going to fire these juices between 30 and 35 watts. So yeah, let's try Minted. Now straight away with this minted e-liquid, I'm getting a nice sharp menthol hit back in my throat. This being mixed with a mint flavour. That mint flavour is going to be a spearmint. A really nice fresh spearmint flavour. It's not like a spearmint chewing gum. This tastes a bit like those soft mint sweets, but the blue ones that are spearmint. With a real extra kick and menthol. There's no cool lard in this juice. I don't think there's any cool lard in any of these juices. These are all pure menthol vapes. If you like a nice spearmint flavour, you'll like that one. A really nice menthol hit as well at the back of the throat. The aftertaste, slightly sweet spearmint flavour. There's nothing else in there. It's just a spearmint and menthol. Really nice, quite refreshing. If you like I said, if you like a nice spearmint flavour, you'll like this one. Yeah, quite nice that one. Let's go change the wick and try the second one. Okay, clean it out, put some new cotton in there. The second flavour I've got loaded up is going to be the Blood Ice Orange. Again, 35 watts. Let's give Blood Ice Orange a quick taste. Now Blood Ice Orange, straight away, it's a real orange flavour. It's not going to be a sweet orange. It's a really tart, almost sour orange flavour. And again, that menthol hit. The menthol in this one isn't quite as strong as the minted. On my exhale though, it is going to be a slight creamy flavour. And another fruit with this one, I have seen on the card, it's going to be a blood orange and other tropical fruits with this one. And the vanilla, that vanilla is there. It's not giving it a vanilla flavour. It's smoothing it out on the exhale. But the other fruits as well. May well be a pineapple because, like I said, on my inhale, it's a really tart, sour orange flavour, which is what I would expect from a blood orange. Blood oranges are not normally sweet. Then that menthol. But then, like I said, when I'm exhaling, it gets to a slight creaminess, which is going to be the vanilla, and then another fruity flavour on the exhale. It could well be a pineapple and maybe even a mango mixed with this. 
It's a nice vape though, this one, because like I said, on the inhale, it's a really sharp, sour, orange and menthol. But then on the exhale, it turns into a smooth, fruitier flavour. I think it's definitely got a pineapple and a mango mixed with this. And like I said, that vanilla, it is there, but I'm not tasting a vanilla flavour. Mm. It's just making it a bit more smoother on the exhale. And the aftertaste is just a nice, sweet, fruity flavour. Do like that one. This is not, like I said, as menthol as the first one, the minted. It is still a menthol, but not too much. And again, like I said, no cool order. It's not going to be cooling sensation. These are purely menthol vapes. Let's try the third one. Okay, final juice, fresh wick. This one's going to be the polarized. Again, 35 watts. Let's give polarized a quick taste. Battery is run out. Sorry, guys. It's not really professional, is it? This is going to be the um, Gen Nano built in battery. I would change it for another Vapresso. Going to put it on this one. This is going to be the Vapresso Taro Nano. Still firing at 35 watts. Let's give Polarize a quick taste. Now with this polarized, straight away, like with the minted, a really strong menthol hit. And then there's a nice minty flavor. It's slightly creamy as well, like with the other one. So maybe a vanilla with this one. It tastes very much like a mint cream, like we get inside the after eight mint. Not the chocolate, the little white stuff inside it. A real nice, minty, creamy flavour, which will be a vanilla, obviously. And again, like I said, a really strong menthol. The exhale, it's going to be nice, sweet, creamy, minty flavour. That one is quite nice as well. It's not too menthol -y. I think the first one, the minted, was going to be the highest one with menthol. The blood ice orange wasn't so bad. This one, it's a bit stronger than the Blood Ice Orange, but not as strong as the Minted. But yeah, a really nice, menthol, minty sort of flavour. Slightly creamy. Maybe a vanilla as well, because it's quite smooth on the exhale. A nice, sweet, minty aftertaste. Yeah, very nice juices actually, I must say. Now this is going to be called the Summertime Blues Range from Tea Juice. I assume they've done this for the nice hot weather, which we are not really getting at the moment. But if you are into your menthol vapes and you like a nice fruity one, especially the Blood Ice Orange, that's a nice fruity menthol vape. These are really, really nice. If I was to pick my favourite, it will be of course the Blood Ice Orange. because I like that orange flavour. And I do believe there's a slight pineapple and a mango flavour in there as well. They've all got this slight creamy smooth aftertaste. So they've all got vanilla in them. There's no, like I said, no cool order. This is purely a menthol range. If you like your menthol vapes, this might be for you. If you're not keen on menthols, this is not going to be for you. Like I said, I personally can vape menthols now and again, but not all day long. It's too much for me. So yeah, big thanks to Liquid Ice for sending these over to me. Down below is a link to my website. On my website, there's a vendors page. On the vendors page, Liquid Ice is already there. Guys and girls, hope you liked the video. Did like the video, why not give me a thumbs up? Dislike it, of course, give me a thumbs down. And yeah, I will see you all on the next one.